would say breathtaking. It's just such a unique style of music, something that I've never been experienced or never been exposed to except in this past year after hearing Dr. Han and um, learning from her. I never knew like how, how music was done in other countries. I just never had thought about it. Um, and just like getting to know more about it, getting to hear all this great music and play all this great music, it's just been like, just breathtaking. It's just absolutely stunning. My name is Jacob Young. I am from the United States of America, from the state of Tennessee. I've lived there my whole life. I'm studying music there. I'm a music education major, so I want to be a music teacher. This past year, joined the Chinese Music Ensemble um, under Dr. Han, and I've been learning the bamboo flute and Chinese music from her. Nice to meet you. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. <laughs> Can we take a photo? Yeah, of course. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. It's been um, a very busy couple of days. We've experienced so, so, so much, and but it's all. I think it's all going to be worth it. And there's a different feeling from like Western music because Chinese music. It, it, all has that more ancient feel to it. You really, um, like you know that this stuff has been played and passed down for centuries and centuries. And then most Western music is only a couple of hundred years old, if that. And it's just so much more like fulfilling, I think, so much more emotional. The arhu, the things, because to me it looked like a weapon, and I was like, that looks cool. Arhu is like a horse, and, and like a bird, and like make di different animal sounds in the arhu instrument. I would say infinite, because I feel like every single day I play the instrument, or every single time I pick up the instrument and start playing it, I feel like I learn something new. Not with just the instrument itself, but with Chinese music, Arhu is definitely, for me at least, it is a bridge to learning different, uh, learning about Chinese culture. It's like dominoes, dominoes, yeah. Like I learn one thing and then another thing and then another thing and another, it just keeps going. You know? And Arhu is definitely, definitely the starting point for me. I first opened the window in the United States, but then I led the way. I held their hands. I brought them here. And so this is a long, long time um, making. I've been teaching Chinese music in the West for almost 30 years as a musician. And next year will be my 50th anniversary being a professional musician. So it's a long road to come to here. So I was thinking if I could get my students to start learning a Chinese instrument, which you meant as a window, so then they can go open the door, not just through the window to look at out. Oh yeah, that's China. No, they would open the door and they would walk out. Then they will go on this journey to explore themselves. That's my most satisfaction. Han Mei 老师呢，实际上是独一无二的。首先，他具有中国传统音乐的这个学习的一个底蕴。其次呢，它具有近三十年的北美的这个教育和实践的这样一个背景。那么它的一些理念呢，实际上是具有国际化的。这个音乐是无国界的一个语言，呃，它能传达的呢，是我们人类最原始、最美好的情感。所以我们也非常希望通过这个活动，能够让美国的这些青少年能够看到。中国传统音乐的美好。
physically, I'm very tired, and actually, I'm exhausted. I need a group of people, like-minded people, to do this all together. You know, as a teacher, the the most rewarding moment is to see that your students fly, fly high, and this group of students can fly high. They really make me proud. Yeah, all I can say, they make me proud.